Hey everybody, welcome to my comparative static video on Monopoly. Uh, here's what we're going to do here. I'm not going to solve for any of the Monopoly stuff. I've already done that. Given this demand, inverse demand curve, given this cost function, I can tell you that the quantity that the monopolist will provide is that, that the price they will charge is that, and the profit they will receive is that. Now, if you want to figure out how to solve those, go check out my other Monopoly videos or look elsewhere. In this video, we're just going to take it for granted. That's the monopolist's profit maximizing outcome. What I'm interested in in this video is how do those choices of Q and P, or how does profit itself change if I change something? For instance, how does production, how does Q change when A increases? Well, to answer that question, I use some calculus. I say the derivative of Q with respect to A is equal to 1 over 2B. Hopefully that looks right. And so what is this telling us? For one thing, it's going to be greater than 0. B is a positive number. A, or as I increase A, my quantity will rise. Because this is a linear demand curve, it will rise at a constant rate. I can tell you the exact rate at which A changes. Next question, I can say how does, I don't know, I can say how does profit change when costs increase? Now we already know costs up is going to be profits down, but let's actually solve for it here real quick. Well, same approach. We go derivative of profit with respect to cost is equal to minus A minus C over B. Now, as long as A is greater than C, which is as long as we're in business basically, uh, this thing's going to come out negative. Higher costs mean greater profits. But specifically, I have exact values I can substitute in. If I know A and C and B, I know exactly how a change in cost, how quickly it will change my profit. So when I am looking at comparative statics, how does Q change when A increases? Well, that means DQ, DA. Change in Q with respect to a change in A. How does profit change when C increases? That's D profit, DC. Comparative statics will always have this form. The thing you're interested in, take the derivative of it with respect to the thing you're changing. So, short video. Hope it's useful. Thanks for watching. Good luck, guys. Happy econing.